Hi friends, where is Winter Express? It's a question lots of you have been asking, so I thought I'd make this short video to talk you through what the situation with Winter Express is in Apex Legends Season 19. As you know, we're fast approaching Christmas and lots of people's favourite game mode around this time of year in Apex Legends is Winter Express. It's an LTM that brings that festive feeling, along with the return of the train, which itself holds plenty of happy memories of OG World's Edge as well as Apex Legends in general. So why are you and many others like you asking for Winter Express? I think one reason is that the current LTM, Revenant Uprising, while fun, doesn't have as much longevity or long-term enjoyment as something like Three Strikes or even Winter Express does. It also doesn't feel that Christmassy. If you think about it, it feels more like a Halloween mode instead of a Christmas mode. And personally, while I do enjoy Revenant Uprising, and I especially like how they incorporated the Kill Code cinematic into it, I feel like I do want something a little bit more Christmassy to enjoy in Apex Legends around this time of the year. And I think that's what's inspiring most of you to ask about Winter Express. So here's the short answer for where it is. Winter Express isn't here and it's not coming to Apex Legends in 2023. That's unless the devs have a sudden change of heart that might just be driven by the community, hence me making this video. The real answer though is a little bit deeper than that. So let me actually explain to you why Winter Express isn't coming in 2023. This is a comment from Josh Medina, one of the devs on Apex Legends. You can see here he's essentially saying the legends are too unbalanced and that will just make Winter Express not fun. And when you look at the examples he's given here, when you combine the train with legends like Catalyst and Conduit and Watson and Newcastle and Rampart and Caustic, you suddenly start thinking, okay, maybe the current legends available with their abilities and the current meta the way it is, maybe just won't suit Winter Express. And that's kind of why the devs haven't brought back this game mode. Now, the simple solution you could say in theory would be to just remove the legends abilities. But then again, once you start doing that, I guess you'll start thinking, actually, how much would that change Winter Express as a game mode? Will the game even feel like Apex Legends anymore? Is that a good thing or a bad thing? Probably not something I can answer, but maybe you've got an opinion in the comments down below. Also, I say the simple solution. To be honest, removing abilities from every legend in the game might not be as technically easy as you might think it is. And I have a feeling if they were to do this technically, it could potentially end up breaking other things in the game, just from what we've seen previously happen in Apex Legends, where you do have big changes to the game. Another option could just be to remove defensive legends, because I feel in theory that would balance things out. And now that you've got the class categories, in theory, just turning off controller legends might suddenly make Winter Express feel a lot more balanced. But then again, if you main one of the controller legends, perhaps you're a caustic main, then you're probably not going to enjoy a solution like that, because essentially you've got a game mode where you can't use your main legend. Anyways, that's the reason why Winter Express hasn't come back in Christmas 2023 to Apex Legends, and from what I hear, we're unlikely to see Winter Express until the earliest being next year in 2024, and that's only if they can find a way to balance the legends. So now you've heard more about the reasoning behind it, let me know your thoughts, and maybe, if you still want Winter Express to come back, we can get some awareness from the devs. For now though, thank you for watching, don't forget to like and subscribe, and I'll catch you later.